It's me, Josh Rucker. Today, we're gonna be doing a push workout. That is chest, shoulders, triceps. Let's get swole. All right, so for all you paralyzed people out there that are doing some exercise, keep it going. I use this belt, I tie it to the end of the bench to help me lower myself back. And then I grab a belt, extra large weighted belt. It's a weightlifting belt. And I strap it around me and the bench. So it helps me stay stable to the bench and makes me feel like I actually have hip control or lower abdominal function. Just makes me feel safer and more control to the bench. All right, so we're moving on to dumbbell, a little bit inclined chest flies. When I do these, I'm gonna keep my elbows a little bit as I come down, get a good stretch. This is really all we want, is just that stretch in that chest, stretch those muscle fibers, and contract back up. Pay attention to my chest. Squeeze my chest, I'm using my muscles, I'm making my muscles on my chest work a little bit harder. All right, this is again another tip for someone that's paralyzed exercising. Try to do compound exercises sitting in your chair. It's gonna make you utilize your upper body way more, your stability and, and your um, abdominals and core structure. You really wanna get that strength in that of the, of the abdominals. You need to be doing compound exercises. You could use dumbbells, cables, whatever you want. I'm gonna use cables so the resistance is always pulling down. This is really going to stabilize me, make me work my core. All right, another tip. We're going to be doing side uh, dumbbell laterals for that middle delt. Again, I'm going to be leaning, holding on the other side like a static hold. Still going to be working my upper body, utilizing it as much as I can as I'm trying to trigger the side delt. Meanwhile, all right, we're doing a unilateral movement. This is a one arm overhead dumbbell tricep extension. Doing this movement makes you really work your stabilizer muscles, strengthens the core, and helps you with your all upper body strength. Uh. Okay, staying in the chair again, doing tricep push downs, really using my stabilizer muscles, utilizing my upper body strength. And then we're gonna move on to push-ups. Again, these exercises really help you with your stabilizer and your strength in your upper body. <laughs> 